Hello, my people. Today, we have got cardio core. Okay, so when I get the heart rate up, we also want to work it. Mm -mm, it's morning time for me, so my, my, my belly is looking nice and toned right now. Let's just get into our body and get loose. Get a little warm with some movement. So shake it out. Maybe some shoulder shrugs. Whatever you need to do, feel present and let everything else go. Let's do some swings, some arm swings. Just loosen it out. And then we're gonna do up and down swings. A little bit of a squat here, so up and let them drop. <sighs> Inhaling up and letting them drop. <sighs> Warming it up. <sighs> <sighs> Inhale, reach, 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 reach. On your tippy toes, reach up and <sighs> exhale, shake. All right, so let's begin with a few standing. We'll go onto the mat and then we'll end with some standing. So just to warm it up here, we're going to plant the legs. The right leg is going to lift up a little crunch. Your right arm can go behind your head here. Left arm, just you can do what I'm doing on your hips. And just crunching, little crunch, not too much. And really going to the side, bringing that elbow closer to the thighs. Let's just do five more, inhaling, exhaling, crunch. Last one, crunch, nice. Reach the arm up and let's go ahead and go to our left side, opening up, stretching that side. Inhale and back down. And let's do that other side, so hand behind your head, grounding, lifting the left and back down. Inhaling, exhaling to a little crunch. Nice squeezing. We got five more. Good. Three to the side. Two and one. Reach arm up. Exhale to the other side. Inhale up. And this time we're going to bring the leg, the right leg out in front of us. So inhaling and drop. So really squeezing the core. You'll feel that just a little bit though. This isn't super intense, but you're definitely feeling it. You're gonna feel it in the leg, the hip flexor, working it. So nice and slow, inhaling and exhaling out. Five more. Yes, get real warm. Three, last two, nice strong balance. And one, sweet. And the other side, any shake you need to do, you would go inhale and crunch, squeeze. Try to come up to your hip level when you come up. Try to move with the breath, so inhaling, exhaling. You don't have to keep that leg straight, but relatively straight if you can. Last three. Crunching, squeezing, and one. Reach up, inhale, elongate, and exhale. Let's go ahead and come on down to the mat. Hopefully we're feeling more warm here. Let's go into our hands and knees, tabletop, back, right leg goes back, extends out, left arm, extend, Reach, inhale, and then exhale, you're gonna crunch elbow to knee, really rounding the back. So you're gonna do moving with the breath. Do eight more, reach, elongate, squeeze the core up, and really crunch it here. Let's do four more, reach, extend, stay tall. Don't let the other arm that's low drop. Keep yourself tall. Just two more, so really make it count. Reach, 
exhaling, emptying out as you crunch, squeezing. Last one. Hold it here on your exhale. Hold it. Hold your exhale. Inhale, reach. Uh, and drop. Nice. And other side. So left leg goes back, squeezing it parallel to the earth. Right arm forward. Inhale. And big exhale as you crunch. Elbow to knee. Inhaling, reaching, elongating. Core is tight. Pulling that core up against gravity. Inhale. Crunch. Nice. Four more. It's like a little bit of a cat cow here. So really rounding as you crunch. Last two. Inhale, reach. And one. Come on. And holding the exhale. Nice and done. Coming back to hands and knees. All right. And let's do a little quick little cat cow here. A little more warmth for the spine. Inhaling, really extending and exhaling, rounding. Last set, inhale, open, arching, exhale, round. All right. Let's go ahead, roll the toes, come onto our plank. We'll start with some, it's gonna work our shoulders a little bit, so we're going to stay stable here. We're going to tap the right arm to the left shoulder and alternate here. So really try to stay stable with the hips and not move too much side to side. So as much stability with the core and the body that you can, keeping that neck and spine neutral looking just between the palms. Keep going. <sighs> getting that, getting that heat, building it up, <sighs> working it. You can always bring your knees down, do what you can so you can keep going. Don't stop. <sighs> Breathing. Five, four, three, two, one. Drop the knees and a little bit, little cobra here. Little cobra, inhaling, looking up, and push back to child's pose just for a moment here. Inhale, gather up some strength, and come on up, back to plank. And from here, just roll forward and back on your toes, keeping that core tight against gravity. And come to neutral, we're going to jack it out. So you can either just step it out for that low impact option, or we're gonna jack it out. Here we go. We're gonna get that heart rate up here. So keep going. Alternate to the step out if you need to. This is our challenge. Stay strong. Keep that good form and keep it up. You got this, come on. <sighs> Incorporate the breath into it. So keeping those breaths nice and long. <sighs> come on, 10, nine, <sighs> six, come on, we got it. Five, four, keep going, three, two, and one. Downward dog, push back, exhale, whoo. Oh yes, so good. Very nice. Lift the hips up. <sighs> Inhale to plank. Knees, chest, or chin, or just straight chaturanga. Inhale up. Oh, and exhale, downward dog. From here, go ahead and raise that right leg to the sky. Dog split, and we're gonna exhale it to the chest. We're gonna do 10 of those. So lift, dog split, and exhaling it to the center, to our chest. Very nice, stay strong, come on. Stay with me. Inhale, split, exhale to chest. Uh, 
halfway there. Come on, we got five more. Uh, we can do it. Pushing through. Love it. Starting the day out right. Come on, we have two more. And last one. Drop that knee to the ground and lift it back up for 10, nine, eight. Drop and lift, six, five, whew, three, two, one. Well-deserved child's pose here. Take a moment and relax. Active child's pose, reach forward with the fingertips. Mm, take a breath, take two breaths. Take a moment to let go. <sighs> Inhale your way back up. Sit down, shake the shoulders out. Woo, yeah. <sighs> Inhale, reach again to the sky. <sighs> Lift up to your knees, clasp the hands behind your back. Open the heart, open the chest. If you want to lift the palms up away a little bit to get a deeper stretch. Mm, one more breath. Ah, and let that go. Shake out the wrists. We're going to do that on the other side. Let's come to your plank. Let's go ahead. From here, push into downward dog. Lift the left leg to the sky. Inhaling and exhale to chest. Nice and strong, very good. Keep going, inhale and exhale. Squeezing it forward, inhaling dog split. Halfway there. Five more. Four, keep the face muscles relaxed. Don't crunch. Just crunching the core. Three, two. Last one, reach. Come to center, drop that knee. 10, and lift. Nine, seven, five, four, three, good. Two, one, and once again, child's pose. Reach for it. And that was a shorter one, so come on back up. All right. So let's do one more plank exercise. Those shoulders are going to be screaming. They're kind of already almost there. So right leg, right elbow, left elbow, right elbow, and back. And then switch left knee to left elbow, right elbow, left, and back. Good, very nice. Just got a few of these, so let's do two on each side. Last set, so one more on this one. And left side, reach, reach, and downward dog. Inhale, knees or straight to chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, child's pose. Whew. Oh, very nice. Mm -hmm. Getting nice and hot. Go ahead and sit down on your booty. All right, from here, legs out in front. Let's do a little bow. And since we're here, so lifting the legs up, inhaling, long spine. Breathe, challenge yourself by straightening, but stay wherever your body's telling you to right now, listening, keeping that tall spine. Breathe just three breaths here. Two. Last one, we're gonna drop those legs. A little bit of a cat-cow holding the behind the knees here. A little bit of a spinal massage. All right, and back to center. So lift up, and from here, we're gonna lift our legs. We're gonna tap 
both hands side to side. Little crunch, little twist. You can exhale on your twist, or you can do longer breaths up to you. Eight, seven, six, three, two. Stay here in the center. Straighten that right leg and left leg. Right, left, keeping that spine tall. Left, ta, ha, ha, ten, nine, eight. Kick it out, seven. Five, four, three, two, one. Straighten the legs. Reach back and whew, let's do five of those. We can do it. It's challenging right now. So inhale deep. Straighten the legs. Reach back and crunch. Three, two, and one. Ah. Lay back down. Reach the arms behind your head. Reach the legs. You deserve this moment. Here, it's just stretch. Ah. Let that back go flat. All right, lift the legs to 90 degrees. Flattening that back on the mat. Hands can come behind your head. Slow mo bicycle. So inhale, crunching, dropping one leg at a time, alternating, twisting up, reaching the elbow to the knee, keeping those knees 90 degrees when they come up. So inhale, as you down, exhale, crunch. Nice and slow, we're really feeling that burn. Taking our time, so feeling it all the way through the core. Upper and lower. Good. Just take it at your pace here, but keep going. A little bit longer. Push through. Push through the mind. If it's telling you to stop, just a few more on each side. Last one on each side, crunch it up, crunch it up, and lay down. Reach again, Ooh, so good. Legs to the sky. Whew. Ah, take a moment here. Going to work the lower core. So plant the arms beside you. We're going to raise the hips up and down. Inhale, exhale. Lift and lower. Really using the core strength to lift as much as you can. Ten. Nine. Mind can't be anywhere but here, right? That's how we stay present. We got five, four, three, two, one. Slowly, slowly decreasing, what is it, bringing down those legs, keeping that back flat against the mat, nice and slow. Could not find the word for drop. There is dropping the legs, ooh, close to the ground, and slowly bring it back up, ooh, yes. Ah, and hug the legs in, a little bit of a back side, side to side. My cat is not as crazy as sometimes. Oh, those are, the, those are the squirrels outside, okay. Oh my goodness, how is your core? Because mine is feeling it. So reach again, reach up, inhale. So bending the knees, planting the feet. We're going to lift the chest to the sky, so we don't want to crunch the neck forward too much, so try to keep that neck neutral. We're going to just reach, alternating sides here, so palms towards alternating knees, crunching up. Try to deepen the breath, but they're quicker breaths here, so it, exhaling, inhale and exhaling. Try to stay deep, but just like big breaths that are quick. Nine, eight, Seven, come on, six, two, four, three, two, 
and one. Woo. Relax, drop the legs. Shake it out here. And let's bring the left leg up, squeeze it in. I love these ones. We're gonna do scissor kicks. We're getting a little bit of a stretch through that leg that you're bringing up. And this other leg can be close to the ground, but don't, don't bring it all the way down. Inhale, exhale. So alternate, bringing that leg in, squeezing towards you, feeling a little stretch. This feels like a little bit of a break. We've done some challenging stuff. This one's not the hardest, but we're still working it. Still in that core strong. The core is working to keep that leg up above the ground. Mm -hmm. So good. Eight, seven, six, five. Last two, one, bring the legs up. And let's do a little bit more of that lower core here again. So you're going to plant the hands or put them on your belly, chest, wherever you want. And lift and lower, lift and lower. <sighs> 10 more, nine. So make it really count. Seven, lifting up with strength, five, four, two, and once again, we're gonna drop nice and slow, nice and slow, a little bit, really slow motion. 10, nine, eight, seven, Oh my goodness, yes, six, working it all, five, that four, upper, lower, mid, core, Ooh, two, and slowly one. bringing it back up, oh my lord. Yes, 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 we got this. Ah, uh, get in. And little swing up, help yourself up. Ooh, yes. From here, we're gonna do basically like a seated bicycle. So bring the arms back, lift the legs, and just alternate. Ooh, yeah, those hip, the hip flexors will feel it too. It's just a little twisting side to side. Don't necessarily have to touch your elbow to knee, but just a little twist here. 10, nine, eight, five, four, three, two, one. Oh yeah. Let's go into butterfly, opening the hips, long spine tall, and stay here or forward fold. Relax the legs. Relax the face, deep inhale. Ah, you can sigh it out and slowly help yourself up. Whew. And we'll come back to our plank exercises. So go ahead into your plank, rolling the toes, push into downward dog, lift the hips, Get into that V shape and plank, nice and slow, inhaling, and just alternating to down dog. As you exhale and inhaling to plank, rolling that spine, exhale. And just a few more like this, moving with your breath, inhaling to strong plank, and inhaling to plank, stay here. Take a breath, and we're gonna drop down to our forearms. Try to keep as stable as you can, and come back to your high plank. So dropping lower, stable, as much as you can. With the hips, you don't wanna to rock too much. A little bit of rocking is natural. Ah, just a couple more of these. Shoulders are working. Ah, last one. Raise it up. Nice push back down dog. And inhale to hands and knees. Go ahead and just drop the chest. Walk the hands out. Little puppy dog here. 
for a moment and breathe. Those shoulders get that deep stretch opener. <sighs> Palms back under you. Let's go into plank once again. And we're going to drop one knee at a time to the earth. So try to keep that spine and neck neutral. Don't look towards your knees. I tend to want to do that sometimes. Just alternating, dropping the knee. Breathing, staying strong. That mental strength, physical strength, it's all here. We need it all to push through these challenges. In this exercise and in life, we got it. Proving to ourselves that we can overcome we can do it. Don't let that, don't let the hips drop. So keep them nice and tall. I know those shoulders are screaming. Just a few more. Three, two, one. Go ahead and child's pose for a moment. Giving the shoulders a break. <sighs> Hands and knees. We're going to roll the toes and just lift the knees up. And let them hover. Holding here. When we're here, we're going to, one leg goes back at a time. And comes back in. Whew. Give me four, three, two, one, down dog. Take a moment here to give a break to those shoulders before we go into mountain climbers for a little more cardio core. Mm. Take a breath, send love and relaxation to the body. <sighs> Come to plank. Are you ready to hit it? We're going to you can either just step into it for that low impact or jump and climb that mountain. Come on. We're almost there to the end, so we're going to push through. Give it what we got. We got left. Climb it. Prove it to yourself that you can do it. You got it. But not if you're in pain. If you're in pain, do something different. Either low impact or Come to your forearms and just hold a plank or take a break. Otherwise, we're gonna push through. Come on, go hard. 10, nine, eight, whew. three, two, one. Drop the knees, puppy dog. Whew. Drop the chest. Oh, so good. Oh, my Lord, so good. Very nicely done. Go ahead and lift up to your knees. Just a little shoulder roll here. Just the front and back. Go ahead. Go into forward fold here. So dropping. The upper body relaxing. The knees can be slightly bent. Shoo, just shake it out. Come halfway lift, hands on shins, elongate. Oof, drop it and then slowly begin to come to standing. Slow unfurls. Go ahead and inhale the palms out and up. As you come up, and hands to heart center. Ah, just a couple more. We're going to have our standing obliques here. So spread the legs out, toes pointing out. Go ahead and drop into this inner thigh squat, palms behind your head. And we're going to crunch to the side. So try not to come forward and really working the side obliques here. 
staying low with the legs. Full body here. Exhale and crunching. You don't have to reach your elbow to your thigh, but you can. But just reaching for it, really crunching. And noticing that my knees aren't going out way beyond my toes. They're staying above my ankles, keeping that supported squat. Keep going. Let's do eight, seven, really crunching. Four, three, two, one. Come to center, stay low. Just arms up, inhale. And exhale, legs straight. And from here, let's just find a stance. Knees are slightly bent. Feet just slightly out, maybe hip distance. Bring the arms in front of you. We're gonna just twist side to side, really isolating the core here. So not not moving those hips, just the upper body, side to side, A little crunch. And we're going to add to this. So maybe separating your legs just a little bit more. Once you go to the right, you go to crunch the left leg up. So single leg crunches. So just the left leg is coming up. Go to the right and left crunching. Just a few more. Two, one. And come to the left, and we're going to crunch to the right, lift the right leg. Here we go. Squeezing the core. Three, two, and one. Let's inhale the arms out and up. Reach. And exhale and down. That was awesome. That was a big challenge. Let's give a little more love to those shoulders. With some rolls. Did that full body, got the shoulders in, the legs in there, and that core. So if you're proud of yourself, roll the shoulders to the front. And let's do one more breath. We're gonna bring our legs into it as we inhale. We're gonna bend the legs little squat, inhale, nice and big, reach, and whew, exhale, let's clasp the hands behind us, just open our heart, maybe a slight smile on our face, knowing we did this work for our progress, our forever progress, building strength and resilience in our mind and body. Opening the heart. Ah, bring the palms to heart center. Gratitude for our body for taking this time to do this. Lots of love to you. Thank you so much for joining me, and I hope you'll check out some more of my videos and join me in a mind, body, spirit journey.